Let's start with the presidents who are at the very tip top of the list, the best presidents. Obviously, on the top of the list, George Washington, our first president, kept the country together, left to office peacefully. The father of the country, a great man, easy pick, right? George Washington as number one. And then everybody knows that the other president, there are only two presidents in this top tier. Lincoln is the other guy in that top tier. Beyond simply leading America through the Civil War to a new birth of freedom, it was Lincoln who, as a, as a thinker, helped to revivify the idea that the Declaration of Independence was an inherent part of the Constitution of the United States, that the two were inseparable. The ideas of liberty were not restricted to the Declaration of Independence as a non-operable piece of legislation, but actually infused the Constitution of the United States and that liberty principles were supposed to be extended to all people of the United States, not merely white Americans. So for that reason, Abraham Lincoln is top of the heap along with George Washington. So that's the easy part, right? That's, that's what everybody does. Washington and Lincoln are the two best presidents. There's very little debate about this. 